Hello guys. So now we are going to talk about the daily programming problem on Git for Geeks. Today's problem is a binary modulo. So the problem is very simple. We are given a two number and basically we have to divide the first number by the second and we need to return the uh, remainder that is uh, like left after the division. But the catch here is uh, the first number is given in a binary string form. So firstly, we will be given the binary string s. We need to convert that into a uh, integer value k, and then we need to divide that with the given m value, and the remainder that will be left after that after the process. We need to return the remainder. So seems pretty easy. But the catch here is uh, the binary string can be large number. So. Firstly, first of all, uh, what comes to our mind is uh, we can uh, do one thing is suppose we have the binary string here as uh, suppose it's the binary string is 101 and uh, that will be equal to uh, 1, uh, 2 and 4 that would be equal to 5. So the <coughs> binary string given is 5 and suppose the m value that we need to uh, uh, divide it with is 3 so the remainder of the process would be uh, 2 so our answer in this case is 2 pretty easy but uh, first of all the the main problem here is we need to convert the string into a integer form and uh, suppose we are given a very large a uh, large binary string uh, suppose with thousand places so uh, that value won't be able to fit into the integer or long value of the uh, any programming language that we are using so so our first approach that is to uh, convert a binary string string to uh, integer and then do the division uh, will fail here okay so second approach we can do is uh, we apply the basic mathematics and perform a binary division so how does the binary division work first of all like uh, we convert uh, we have our original binary string we convert our other value to the binary value also so this is our s value we have converted our m value to binary string as well and then we do the uh, simple binary uh, binary division that include like uh, comparing the first most significant bits and then uh, multiplying the value of uh, the divisor by a certain number and then dividing and then keep following repeating the step till we can no longer divide and the remaining value will be our remainder and then we convert the rema uh, remainder string into an integer value and return that so this process can uh, be used to do the solution but it will be a very lengthy process and uh, that would be like the solution generated would be a very complex one so here is a simple catch that we uh, can use to solve this problem uh, we can use is uh, we can use big int in java that can store a large uh, numbers that uh, that is able to store very large numbers so and uh, those numbers can uh, uh, and don't, then those numbers can be used to divide and then uh, get the remainder value so we'll follow the third approach so now if i show you the code for the third approach it would be something like uh, here so in this uh, we are for uh, simply converting our uh, dividend uh, we have the divided string and the divisor string into uh, like converted to binary string then uh, we have taken the string builder and uh, as the quotient and remainder quotient we do not need require here but uh, like for the sake of division we have took it and then uh, 
we have converted our uh, values to big int that is the uh, we are using java here so java support big int and when we can convert very large values to any integer format and after that we just simply need to uh, do the division we need to like begin divide and remainder dividend and remainder will get in the result and then we can use those values and we have like uh, simply use the integer dot parse int method to convert the string into a like binary string into integer value and we have returned it so the solution is pretty simple and hope you get the solution